Another powerful storm on the way for southwestern Montana. I'm Chief Meteorologist Mike Kurt. Got your on-demand storm tracker forecast update. Here's the next weather maker hitting the coast Wednesday afternoon. This whole thing will begin to move inland, but this area of pressure is going to be driving some significant banding of snow across portions of our viewing area, and it's roughly for higher terrain. But as I told you yesterday, it's the mountain ranges like the Gallatin and Madison ranges of the Absorca Beartooth Wilderness, possibly even the Bridger Range and Crazy Mountains will see a significant amount of potential snow. I think the National Weather Service is being modest about six inches, and some of our models are showing a lot more than that is possible Friday afternoon into Saturday morning. It starts off tomorrow afternoon, beginning to lead into the region with very disorganized moisture, a little bit of rain and snow punching through. But here it comes by the early morning hours on Friday. It could have an impact over Bozeman Pass, but it stretches out from Dillon to Bozeman southeastward, and it's just sitting right over Madison, Gallatin, Park Counties through a better part of the day on Friday. It could begin to push back towards the west, increasing the chance for rain or snow in Butte Friday afternoon. But Friday night, Saturday morning, it's just sitting there. And again, it could have a big impact on some of our mountain ranges as we look into an accumulating forecast here from uh, Wednesday, Thursday, Friday, and Saturday morning. It stops here about 3 a.m., but it still continued to snow into the uh, morning hours on Saturday. So some of these numbers could go up, but we could be picking up uh, a foot or more around Big Sky and possibly up to 6 to 10 inches Cook City to Red Lodge. So again, some of our mountain ranges are going to see some beneficial moisture out of this next go around, but everyone should see some rain or snow even in the lower valleys Thursday, Friday, Saturday, and a nice warm up and a general drier weather pattern as we look into the early half of next week. And a good chance for rain Thursday for Bozeman could be mixed rain or snow, could even accumulate snow in the early morning hours on Friday and Saturday, and watch for that. That could lead to some slow go travel in the Bozeman area.